Easy I 9 News reporter Connor McCarthy is live tonight outside of an apartment building in Eugene with what the affidavit is saying. Connor? Well, Matt Renee, I just spoke with a neighbor of the victim, and he says he didn't hear anything coming from the apartment last Friday night, but he said he did witness a large police presence. But according to this three-page affidavit, Zachary Bryant allegedly assaulted his victim here at the tennis apartments in Eugene all over a phone charger. In an interview with police, the victim says her and Brian have been in a relationship for two years. She also says she was asleep in bed when Brian came over and started screaming for his charger. She says that's when Brian began to punch her. Brian allegedly pulled her out of bed and the two began fighting on the stairs. At one point, the victim says Brian began to choke her to the point she thought she was, he was going to kill her. A neighbor in the building tells me he's shocked about learning what happened that night. I didn't hear like any actual violent stuff going on. I just noticed when the police came and I wasn't the only neighbor. A few of us were outside looking like, why is there police here? In court documents, police say Brian was vague and evasive during his interview. And Matt Renee, Brian will have his arraignment tomorrow in Lane County Court on, different, on eight different charges. And those charges include menacing, assault in the fourth degree and felony strangulation. Live in Eugene, Connor McCarthy, KZI 9 News.